So let's talk about one of the most underrated devil fruits in One Piece, the pawpaw fruit, or otherwise known as the Nikyu Nikyu no Mi, which is Kuma's devil fruit. This is a paramecia style devil fruit that grants the user the ability to repel anything they touch, even if it's intangible. As a matter of fact, Kuma has the ability to even repel memories, emotions, pain, fatigue, and anything else that he feels like. And just with a touch, he can travel at the speed of light or send somebody flying at the speed of light and go anywhere he wishes as long as he knows the location. The only reason why this devil fruit is so underrated is because we've only seen Kuma use it a handful of times. And even though he's used it well, the devil fruit is always at the mercy of the user, so if Kuma's creativity is limited, so will the devil fruit. Now the only downside to this devil fruit is that the power is located at the palms of the user's hands. So if he's not fast enough to deflect the attack, then the attack will hit him. But aside from that, again, I will stress that he can deflect anything he touches, whether it's intangible or not. Which in my opinion, makes Kuma's Devil Fruit one of the most dangerous and overpowered in all of One Piece. Taking that meaning at face value would mean that he can just slap Law's room out of existence or out of the way. He can take out somebody's soul, he can remove somebody's memory, he can just do anything he wishes if he just touches you. Which also makes Kuma's Devil Fruit one of the most diverse paramecias or devil fruits in One Piece period. It can be used offensively and defensively and it can do so many other things that I can't even begin to imagine. The potential of this devil fruit is truly limitless and we haven't even seen it awaken. And this is simply why Kuma's devil fruit is one of the most underrated in One Piece. Like always, thank you for watching and let me know your thoughts in the comments.